Hi, I'm Narid Ansari and in this video we're gonna talk about how you can have looking around with mouse input. So without any further ado, let's begin. You remember from last video, we get the character, we put it in a variable, we had jump, we had backward and for forward movement, we have left and right movement, and let's see how it looked like. With W we can go forward, with S move backward, with D and A we can go left and right. So now, what about mouse, looking around with mouse, right? So for that, first of all, let's just go to project setting and in project setting create a new axis mapping in here and I want to call it axis mouse left right okay and I want to give it the mouse x so with mouse x we can look left and look right okay so if we look uh, right it will give us one and if we look left it will give us minus one right so if we change this scale to two for example it will go uh, look right faster and look right faster so let's just put that one i will show you how what effect it has if we change it to two okay now we have this mosaic so let's just go to our player control and in here like always get the reference to our character again that we get up here we get our character we put it in variable so everywhere we can use it right so the next is access that access mapping that we create access most left right okay that's it so now that we have this with this most left and right that is most x I want to change the rotation of our player like this. If we go to our scene, let's just find this, this start point, this player starting here. You can see in rotation, there is roll, there is pitch, and there is yaw, okay? So let's just change the pitch. You can see it. Uh, the pitch is for uh, looking down and up, and you can see it. And for this yaw, we, it's for looking right, left and looking right and you can see it how it works okay so what we want to change is this yaw movement looking right and looking left you can see it the yaw if you hover over it you can see it says z yaw in parentheses okay so with that just search add yaw and it find add controller yaw input okay and that's what we want let's just connect this execution pin to here and access value to here and that's all you need to do that's how easy it can get let's just compile and go to our gameplay and you can see with most we can left right and left and we can go forward we can go right left that we wrote before and you can see everything is working fine but let's just do it for looking up and down so before doing that let's just select all of these and comment it out with looking right and left let's just bring it down to here so now if we zoom out you can see what section does what okay so now for looking up and down first of all go to project setting add another axis mapping in here and i want to call it axis mouse up down and i want to call it this okay and for for this action for this axis i want to use most y okay so now let's just go here again like before just uh, get the character from here and search for axis mouse up and down and now what we want is add pitch movement okay so you know that how we find out how, what what is the pitch if you go to your scene you can see our character has a roll pitch and yaw and in this case we want to look up and down and with this pitch we can do that so let's uh, so that's why we we use add controller pitch input so let's just connect this to here and connect this access value access value to here and it should work right before doing anything else just open up the character and in, and in here in details panel go to pawn category and in here check both of these use controller rotate pitch and use controller rotation yaw so you should check both of them the yaw will be checked by default but for uh, controlling pitch you should check this pitch as well so with that you can control the pitch and yaw of your character in player controller class so do that first compile and in here if you run our game again up and down is working but the problem is that uh, when you move your mouse forward it's in reverse so how we can fix that you can just go to up and down and change this scale to minus one to reverse it right so now if we run our game everything is working like other games okay everything is working 
and you remember in my character we did use a spring arm and I did explain what this uh, spring arm is for if you didn't watch my videos about creating character just watch that it has a lot of cool information in it so if you play our game with that spring arm let's say we are here and if the player want to go this way you can see in left corner uh, there is a wall and with that spring arm the spring arm changed the, the change the camera position so it won't go through wall and you can see it it's perfect okay and you can see it it's just perfect you should always use that a spring guard right so now everything is working fine we have movement and in the next video i'm going to show you how you can pause your game so that was it for this video it's my honor to have you at the end of this video please if you want to help me hit that like button it's very much important to me thank you very much for watching bye